what I really would bring back home from, from this trip is basically two things. The first one is working together. That the strength of working together is, is enormous, of different people, different rages, different, had different backgrounds. So that's number one. The second thing that I bring home is the happiness of the, of the kids. Happiness of the people here, the way they live, the happy they are, and the way they develop their lives. is like um, a society like with this free generation where um, education or where uh, information is um, it's easy for us or for, for one another to um, to uplift one another and to share information um, to make everybody throw or to see a change in, in, in Masi and uh, we see like an, an integrated uh, culture whereby no one is like discriminating one another <laughs> Congratulations for the good questions. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, Mandela said Ubuntu is I am somebody because of somebody else. And my question to you is what how do you experience Ubuntu in your daily life? Psychologists tell you tell us that you would not you would not be able to speak as a human being if you were taken away and and locked up somewhere you would not be able to speak as a human being you would not be able to think as a human being and maybe you would also not even be able to walk as a human being because you learn how to be human from other human beings. What, what, do you, what do you do to win a Nobel Peace Prize? And, and I said, oh, that is quite easy, actually. <laughs> you need only three things. You need to have an easy name. <laughs> you need to have, to have a big nose. <laughs> and, and I was uh, wearing shorts, and, and then I stretched out my, my legs and I said, we have got to have sexy legs. 